Agnat Yob, painter, March 28, 1895, April 28, 1936, was an important representative of color expressionism in the art scene of Yugoslavia during the 1930s. Yob's landscapes of Dalmatia are reminiscent of the style of Van Gogh. He is best known for his series of paintings inspired by life on the island of Brac. Yob said that the beneficial influence of the Brac landscape can be felt, the hot sun, blue sea, and green branches of olive trees swayed by the breath of the maestral. His paintings depicted the Mediterranean landscape, motifs of the town of Supatan, fishing themes, and more rarely portraits and nudes. Agnat Yob was born in Dubrovnik on March 28, 1895. His family hailed from Udine, modern-day Italy but came to identify first as Catholic Serbs and then as Croats, Yob himself identified as a Serb. Yob's father died when Yob was five years old. He attended school in Dubrovnik until 1910. An important influence on his early intellectual and artistic development was his older brother Svito, 1892-1915. studies in Belgrade and Munich came to an end when he went off to fight in the First World War for the Serbian army. As an active supporter for independence from Austria-Hungary, the young Njat Yab was arrested in 1912 along with other young nationalists and sentenced to one month in prison. In 1913, when Yab was 18, his daughter, Maria, was born. Arrested again in 1914 he spent time in Shebenik prison, then removed to a mental hospital, thanks to good connections, until September 1916. Traumatic experiences from his two-year stay in the mental hospital oppressed job in the years that followed, and left a mark on his work, most notably on Madman in the Yard. A drawing thought to have been made between 1916 and 1919, in 1917 Yab moved to Zagreb with his mother and younger brother Nikola, where he enrolled in the Arts and Crafts College. Yab fell in love, and married Vectria Horšić. After spending the summer in Dubrovnik and on Lopiu, the couple moved back to Zagreb for the autumn. However, the relationship was not to last, and they divorced in 1920. In that same year, Yob's mother died, and due to irregular attendance. He lost his place at college. The family fortune had been used up in enforced war loans. The purchase of the flat in Zagreb, and the education of the children. Yab now found himself dependent on the goodwill of friends, and increasingly prone to bouts of depression and ill health. In December 1920, Yab went to Italy, visiting Rome, Naples, and Capri. Traveling back through Dubrovnik and Zagreb, he went on to Belgrade. Spending time there with local modernist artists, most notably Peter Dobrovic. There also, in 1923, Yab met and married his second wife. Zvuka Svetkovic, and their daughter Svita was born in the summer of 1924. In the spring of 1925 Yab was diagnosed with tuberculosis and spent the summer being treated at Avchar Kabler Gorge. After which the family moved to the village of Kulina, near Khrushchevax. There he painted his memories of the coast, mostly on small panels. 
Yob converted to Orthodox Christianity and married his second wife in the Church of St. Sava in Belgrade. Yob's son Rasko, named after his godfather the writer Rasko Petrovich, was born in October 1925. He soon fell ill and died in March of the following year. son left a deep impression on Yob's mental and emotional state. In the summer of 1927 the family moved to Vadis, near Shibenik. And from 1928 they lived in Supatar on the island of Brock. There, Yob embarked on the most creative time of his artistic career, and his style began to resemble that of Van Gogh. Yob's focus was on recording the impulse of his personal feelings. And strong expressiveness became a feature of his work. The following year, 1929, he held his first solo exhibition in Split. Which was well received by public and critics alike. By his next solo exhibition at the Salon Gallic in Split. Yob's style had developed more toward expressionism. Between 1934 and 1935, Yob lived in Belgrade and Zagreb, then returned to Supatar. He died of tuberculosis in a Zagreb clinic on April 28, 1936. Ignat Yob's best, most creative and expressive work was produced in a very short period of time. still showed the influence of the spring salon, with rounded forms and more muted colors. However, inspired by the scenes of his native Dalmatia, and driven by his own personal demons, Yab went on to become one of the most expressive painters in the Croatian modern art scene of the 1920s and 30s. In his later works he demonstrated fauvism techniques and strong, expressive use of color. Yob saw landscape as a symbol, and used color as an expression of his emotions. His personal experience of life and his reaction to the environment and its native people. His art was grounded in the earthy island lifestyle, and he pursued his own personal vision. As the critic Igor Zaidich says all of the content in Job's work, from 1928 to his death, are locally and regionally marked, always concrete, borrowed from the real world and the little towns of Dalmatia in which he scrimped and lived. Full of ambiental tone and color, melodies, events and figures. He was a careful observer, with a lot of sense for humor, for the comic and tragicomic. For the mad, the ridiculous, the fantastic and the drunk. Thank you. 